What up, y'all? Um, I usually don't, like, pre-record videos the day before I upload them, but I'm recording this the night of the day before I upload this because it's just something that kind of pissed me off a little bit, but I think it's important to share with you. So, I, uh, on the side, I do like photo related things like i'm a photographer but i kind of offer like photo booth services for parties too and i booked this gig for uh i'm not gonna say how much but i booked this gig, this gig for a certain amount and i use um my one of my partner's equipment one of my business partners uh has a photo booth that i use and I originally just worked like under him and he would pay me a a low amount for running the booth, in my opinion, um, for the amount of time I would have to do it. And sometimes the distances I would have to drive, uh, he would pay me a pretty low amount. And the, the thing is now it's like, okay, I got a referral and Obviously, I have to give him something because it's his equipment. But when I've worked with him, worked with him, I've proven time and time again how much of a valuable asset I am to him. And I've I've literally built his website. I helped him start his LLC. I did all these things. Uh, you know, I've solved problems, mechanical problems with the photo booth that a normal worker wouldn't have been able to do. Um, just because, you know, I'm, I'm smart and I know my way around situations. Uh, but, but, you know, when I went to him with this, this referral I got, or, or no, I actually did book an event. And I was asking him to use the booth and obviously can use it. And we we're talking about how much he wanted to be paid. So I came out with, uh, you know, again, I'm not going to say the number, but I came up with a certain number and... Um, actually, I'm going to say the number. Why not? Yeah, so I, I said I was going to give him 50. Uh, just for, He doesn't even have to do anything. I'm just using the equipment. Like it's, it's money that he wouldn't otherwise even have. Okay. So I said 50, and I did this on purpose because it was a number which was lower than I think he would. Like I, You kind of want to get a negative reaction out of your first offer to someone when you're trying to you know either sell or in this case you're trying to sell how much you want to give them but generally you want to give them a bad reaction to your first offer so your next offer sounds a lot better so i said fifty dollars um some of you you know for doing nothing fifty dollars i'm sure would sound a lot like sound like a lot to you but yeah, he, he kind of laughed at that, which is really disrespectful, honestly. It was really rude because he would pay me a low amount, too, for how much work I would put in. He's doing nothing. He'd get 50. But the point is, uh, this whole sales process was annoying. We went back and forth, but we I eventually leveraged the cost of something and said I would pay him that much. And because the event I was doing, it's going to have like 250 people and they're all rich. So like there'll be referrals i kind of use that as leverage and i just said i would give him i think a hundred like 125 i think i said i would give him which is like 125 out of the undisclosed amount is pretty amazing considering you're doing nothing look maybe people think i'm wrong for this but this world is is really messed up and people will take advantage of you for your for your brain for your labor if you're a smart person and you're in your hustle era people will take advantage of you so hard bro and they do not care bro these people do not give a damn about you they would ruin relationships just be, just to make an extra buck okay these are some real bad people out here and i don't even think they realize it but it's just, it's it's not good, okay? So, you gotta protect yourself, bro. You gotta make sure that the people you're working with, they ain't gonna screw you over because even if they think that, like, they won't, like, 
they can. And you'll have a bad feeling about these people too. But you'll kind of put rose-colored glasses over them. Nah. Honestly, most people are out to get you, bro. There's very few people in this world who want you to win. So you have to fight for yourself. You can't be relying on these people. Now, obviously, did I win the exchange in terms of, you know, the money? Yeah, obviously. He was saying things like 50% like that he wanted. I'm like, no, no, bro. 50%. Are you joking? Because <laughs> I need to make some money. I made, I made good money on this, bro. I made bank. Like... Listen, just for yourself, you have to learn to respect the people that help you, okay? And you have to also respect yourself when you help people and they don't respect you, okay? You can't let these people finesse you for your bands, for your time, for your work. Like, you got to be the one to finesse, but only do it to people who you know, like, don't have your best interest. Don't finesse your boys. Like, if you're doing something for, for like, a friend or a relationship you want to keep stable, don't finesse them for an extra buck. But if there's people out here who have proven to you that they do not give a single... Like, they would rather see you lose and then make, like, an extra 50 bucks than, than anything. Like, they do not care. I don't, I don't really like to, to curse in my videos because I know a lot of kids might be watching this. But, like, you, <laughs> I want to, to, to swear a lot, bro, because it's something to be really careful about. And when you, look, when you look back on the mistakes you've made related to something like this, it really makes you angry. It's like, bro, there's no way I could ever fall for something like this. And you did. And that's how it is. Uh, you gotta protect yourself. I'm, I'm, I keep reiterating this. You know, there's, there's times in life where you have to learn to, to, to know your role, and shut your mouth. <clears throat> but there's also time where you have to be the top dog. Okay, you have to control the situation. I'm shaking the camera a lot. <clears throat> this is why I like, I like playing chess so much because you have to know how to encounter with these people. Okay, that whole phone call I had with this dude when I was proposing to him how much he would make from this, it was like a chess game in my head. Every move that he would make, I had put him in check again and again and again until I finally got him in checkmate. All right? I could have got him down to 100 probably, but you'll know in your there's times in your life when it's just not worth putting up with people, all right? Sometimes it really is worth just throwing money at people to shut them up. Okay, so I could have finessed him for a hundred and been like, you know, I, I help build your website. You know, people charge thousands of dollars website to make websites. I helped you start your business, saving you who knows how much on taxes. You're not paying me that. Like, there's so many things I could have leveraged, but I'm not that type of person. And honestly, I don't have time to be that to to hurt relationships that I at least want to keep stable. Because, like, this guy is someone who, he's a good person, I think, maybe. But he's not the best to me. So, but he, he has value to me, and I have, <laughs> oh, I know how much value I have to him. Uh, so, it's not really worth being too antagonistic about things. Uh, yeah, just a quick life lesson there for you i kind of dragged this video out a long time but just i had to rant and uh, i need some content to post this was certainly some content that i need you boys to hear uh, i mean if you have any experiences you want to share with me please feel free um i link the discord that we have in the description uh, we're building that community right now so if you could join that, that'd be so helpful. It's free, of course. Um, and you can get in contact directly with me if you have any questions about anything like life, uh, fitness, business, all that stuff I can help you out with uh, for absolutely free. Uh, we're just trying to build a community in there, get people going. Um, 
nice close knit group of people with with like minded you know mentalities yeah uh like the video if you found this helpful uh, subscribe for more and comment any questions or experience you have to share thanks for watching bro